vast blue of the ocean stretches endlessly, calm and quiet on the surface, but beneath, the engines of war stir once again. In 2025, the United States Navy unveils one of its most formidable machines to date, a next-generation massive battleship, redefining naval warfare in the 21st century. Decades after the traditional battleship faded from the fleet, this new behemoth has arrived, and it's not just for show. The USS Leviathan, as it's been unofficially dubbed by naval enthusiasts, represents the rebirth of sea dominance in an increasingly unpredictable global landscape. Measuring over 950 feet in length and displacing nearly 100,000 tons, the Leviathan is larger than any active surface combatant in the world. It dwarfs even the latest destroyers and cruisers, and while it may echo the mighty Iowa-class battleships in stature, its mission and technology are light years ahead. Powered by a dual-reactor nuclear propulsion system, this ship can cruise indefinitely without refueling. The propulsion technology offers both immense power and agility, capable of pushing the massive vessel beyond 35 knots, a surprising feat for a ship of this size. What truly sets the Leviathan apart is its armament. Gone are the traditional 16-inch guns. In their place are three state-of-the-art electromagnetic railguns, capable of firing hypervelocity projectiles at over Mach 7. These weapons use electromagnetic force to launch shells with such speed and precision that they can reach targets hundreds of miles away in mere seconds. Complementing the railguns are vertical launch systems, over 400 cells, equipped to fire a mix of Tomahawk cruise missiles, standard interceptors, and hypersonic strike weapons. The battleship also boasts directed energy weapons, powerful lasers that can disable incoming missiles, drones, or even enemy aircraft. Above deck, the battleship is a fortress. Its hull is cloaked in advanced radar-absorbing materials, giving it a low radar profile despite its massive frame. The superstructure is sleek and angular, designed with stealth in mind, making it harder to detect and target. It's equipped with a next-gen Aegis combat system, capable of integrating with satellites, aircraft, submarines, and unmanned systems to provide real-time situational awareness. Every inch of the ship is a testament to modern military engineering. Inside, the crew quarters, command centers, and weapons control rooms are a blend of functionality and futuristic design. Operated by a reduced crew thanks to automation and AI assistance, the Leviathan can function with fewer than 300 sailors, significantly less than battleships of the past. The ship's command hub is a high-tech nerve center, with digital holographic displays and real-time battle simulations. AI not only assists with targeting and defense but also predicts threats based on data analytics, offering preemptive strategies before a human officer even has to issue a command. On the flight deck, the Leviathan supports a complement of drones, including underwater, surface, and aerial systems. This versatility allows it to project power far beyond visual range, conducting surveillance, strikes, and anti-submarine missions without endangering human lives. And for close quarters defense, the ship mounts multiple layers of security, from close-in weapon systems to counter torpedo arrays and anti-drone lasers. But why bring back a battleship in 2025? The answer lies in shifting global dynamics. In an era where peer adversaries are developing long-range anti-ship weapons and cyber capabilities, the U.S. Navy needed a platform that could not only survive but dominate in high-threat environments. The Leviathan serves as a floating command center, missile arsenal, and mobile fortress, capable of withstanding electronic warfare, missile barrages, and sustained combat operations. It's designed for the Pacific theater, where vast distances, contested waters, and island chains demand a powerful presence. From the South China Sea to the Arctic, the Leviathan can deploy rapidly, support amphibious operations, and provide missile defense for carrier strike groups. It doesn't just hold the line, it defines it. In war games and simulations, the Leviathan has already proven its value. It outperformed older classes in endurance, firepower, and resilience. It's a symbol to both allies and adversaries that the United States is prepared to project force anywhere, anytime. Critics argue that the battleship era ended for a reason, that they're expensive, large targets. But the Leviathan isn't a rehash of history. It's a response to modern threats with modern solutions. With cyber-hardened systems, modular weapon upgrades, and multi-domain integration, it's built for flexibility. If needed, its railguns can be swapped for new weapons. Its systems can evolve as threats change. 
It's not just a battleship, it's a platform for the future. As she cuts through the sea with silent power, the USS Leviathan reminds the world of one thing. When deterrence is needed, and when peace must be backed by strength, nothing speaks louder than a ship that can turn the tide of war before it even begins. The United States has sent a message in steel, speed, and firepower, the battleship is back, and it's more powerful than ever. Oh,